Hello, hello, everybody. I'm Steve Reinhardt, CEO and CTO of Artificial Intelligence Technology Solutions. This is a big weekly update, so definitely watch through the whole thing. There are a lot of things in here that I want you to know, maybe more so than prior weekly updates. Quick little insertion into this week's weekly video. I'm just pulling home right now and uh, did a quick visit to the Rex and a quick visit to Skunk Works this week. And I just want the team members who are on AITX's team to know that you guys are friggin' incredible. You guys are just amazing. The quality of work, the quality of commitment is outstanding. And I just want you to know I'm super happy to be standing with you on this journey. And on behalf of me, on behalf of our investors, on behalf of your colleagues and teammates, thank you. It's just wonderful going through this journey with you guys. So just wanted to slip that in. Let's get back to your regular scheduled programming. The first big announcement that I want to talk about is HERO, our Humanoid Engagement Responsive Officer announcement. Now, this thing is amazing. This thing really connects with people, right? Excuse me, sir. Are you authorized to work in this facility? I, I'm just here, just working. I must ask you to leave the premises. What do you mean? What do you mean I can't be here? You are not authorized to be here. All right, all right, all right, fine. I'll pack up and go. I appreciate your acceptance of this request. That humanoid form connects with people. I encourage you, if you just read the headline when the press release was issued on Thursday, please read the press release, read what I wrote, read about the applications that we can now bring RAD technology to. Now, from our perspective on AITX, we wanna develop and deploy solutions at the lowest capital cost to us as we possibly can. And by having our RAD pack built from the ground up to be put on other devices as we did with RAD Dog, we built the RAD pack for RAD Dog. We're doing the same thing for Hero. This lets us get into the humanoid solutions game at a much lower price. Actually, it would be impossible for us to get into the humanoid game with the resources that we have right now. We just don't have the money. But we can build rad packs. We could put our technology on it because it's already been developed. And most importantly, we can deliver, deploy, and build revenues during this method. So that's what Hero is. It's a big deal. Since January 15th, and we have been working unbelievably hard, we announced to you Sarah, which is already racking up sales and is on track to be a significant part of revenue for fiscal year, for next fiscal year, right? So huge. Sarah delivering. That was a big announcement. I wanted to get out to you. Salespeople are tacking it onto deals. It's amazing. I love it. Love it. Love it. Lots more innovation coming out of Sarah. The next announcement that I, that I couldn't say at the time because we needed to do more development on it was Hero. So these are two huge announcements that elevate us even further as a leader in this space because nobody has the breadth of solutions that we have. There is one stop. If you want security and facility safety, we're the guys. So now with Hero and the rest of the line, we are a full one-stop shop for the safety and security of your facilities and your staff. Huge. This is what we've been working for for so long. So huge announcement on Hero. Very excited about it. I'm excited to see where it goes. I'm really happy about the response that I saw on Thursday and Friday from everybody. So I think everybody's as excited as I am. Uh, but really, really, really cool news. Low entry cost for us because we've spent millions of dollars to get this far already. Uh, so we'll see how quickly we can uh, get some of those deployed. I'm estimating end of the year, give or take, you never know. Okay, next big news to note is that we filed a 14C information statement with the SEC uh, on Friday uh, to increase the authorized shares from 15 billion to 20 billion. We'll talk about how that works in a minute, but I want to note that over the course of our last few authorized raises, we've built a real business. It's enabled us to create, hire, build, deploy, and further build this business to where it is now. And where are we now? We have an incredible suite of innovative solutions. We have continuously growing 
recurring monthly revenue, and we have a real path towards positive operational cash flow this year with continued bright prospects. All good stuff. All things that if we continue as we are and could and should result in greater attention to our company, and that serves all of our purposes. Now, let me share how this works. After the AS race is completed, we're just going to continue to use the S1 or S3 that's previously been filed to sell chunks of shares to our institutional investor at a slight discount to market. In turn, these become their shares. They can buy more, hold, sell, or whatever. I'm going to make an obvious statement here. We all want the price to go up. It is in everybody's interest. Now, let's talk some simple math. There is a number that I'd like to raise every month to keep this ship sailing forward with our team and everything that we're doing. Again, a higher share price serves all of our purposes. This year, everybody knows that we're dramatically slowing down our growth of SGNA in order to plant the goalposts that we have to hit for operational positive cash flow. Nothing's changing there. We expect and want to hit operational positive cash flow this calendar year with our hard work, a little bit of luck, and great performance, right? So that's what we're going to do. But the reality of it is, is at this moment right now, we have to buy inventory, okay? We have to have stuff to sell. There's going to be a press release that is going to share why we are increasing the authorized. And we're going to talk about how we have to buy rad dogs and heroes and Romeos and Rios and so, stuff like that, right? Stuff that we need money for inventory. Okay. Great reasons to raise money. We're not draining it into SGNA. Remember, SGNA is hopefully going to be a hundred percent covered through positive operational cash flow sometime this year. So now we need capital to buy inventory, deploy it, make money, it continue our revenues going up. That's the reason for the authorized increase. Okay, folks, I've got to get back to work. It is so busy. I'm having so much fun. Reach out, comment, like, share. Thank you very, very much.